My intellect is without limit. Do you like combos? I love combos. I like the Big Mac with the extra large fries and king size soda. <laughs> Stacks back, screw phase MTG. So today we're going to dive into a combo deck. Aether Flux Reservoir. It's been one of my most favorite cards ever since it came out when Kaladesh was released. I have it in a bunch of commander decks, so I'm glad it's finally on Arena and we get to play with it. Well, it was on Arena in the beta, but I didn't play Arena in beta, so I never actually got to play Reservoir on Arena. So, um, we're going to dive into the deck here. This is a super combo deck, but before we do, if you're watching this video and you have not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you as a permanent part of the channel, <laughs> and I would love for the channel to grow. Um, I've been hovering on, on 1,500 subscribers here for a while, so... I'm hoping that we can kick those numbers up by the end of the year, maybe hit 2,000. Um, I'm trying my best to get the channel to grow, so um, I, I would appreciate a little help from all of you. So go ahead and hit that sub button, hit the like, comment on the video, you know, all that stuff. It helps the algorithm in YouTube, it, you know, sees the videos and, you know, it says, hey, Stack's doing a good job. Hey, here's more viewers and potentially more subscribers, so go ahead and and do that. I know a lot of my viewers are, are, I look at my analytics and a lot of them are not subscribers. So go ahead and hit that sub button. You keep coming back viewing the videos, hit that sub button. <laughs> so <laughs> enough of that. Um, let's go ahead and dive into this deck. So Aether Flood Reservoir, for those who have been sleeping under a rock, um, let's go ahead and uh, explore what the, de what, the, what the actual card does here. So it says whenever you cast a spell, you gain one life for each spell you've cast this turn. Um, yeah, so you're going to be gaining one life every time you cast a spell. And then, well, you're going to gain one life for every spell you cast before the spell that you cast. So if you cast your first spell with this out, you gain one life. And then if you cast another spell, then you gain two lives. So it just grows exponentially um, with each spell you cast. So... But the big part on it is to pay 50 life and go ahead and do 50 damage to any target. That's that's what we're going to be killing our opponent with. Uh, I know there's a there's a few variations of people trying to to, to toy around with Aether Flux Words War out there. There's there's somebody posted a list already um, on Facebook when I made a post about me um, putting this deck list out today. Somebody shared a, a, a I don't know where they got the deck list from, but it was one that was running Ugin and it had. Uh, the the clockwork colossus or whatever that that eleven eleven thing is that 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 came out with uh with with Kaladesh, um, but this is a, this is my version. Okay, so the what we want to what we want to do with this version here is we just want to combo off in one turn. Okay, we're not worrying about playing Ugin. We're not worrying about playing creatures. Um, we just want to get the setup and go ahead and combo off and just kill our opponent in one turn. They. All of the other stuff doesn't matter. You don't need creatures. You don't need Ugin. You don't need none of that because none of it matters if your opponent's dead. <laughs> so that's what we're going for. Um, honesty about the deck, I would say this is definitely a tier two deck for his store because there's a lot of decks out there that are seeking to kill you by turn three, turn four at the latest, and they and they are very efficient at doing so. So um, <clears throat> I recommend not ever keeping any hand with this deck that does not have uh, a guardian idol or a mind stone in your hand because you're just going to be too slow coming out of the gate you got to have at least one of these in your opening hand to even try to compete with with this deck so uh, just keep that in mind uh, but yeah this is definitely a tier two deck because of all of the speedy decks that are out there but you can beat some of those speedy decks if you get the right draws or if they just happen to just draw bad you know see it, it happens so i've beaten some goblins and all and all that good stuff with this deck. So, um, and one more thing to remember. Well, we'll get into that after we go through the deck here. So, uh, we got four guardian idol. We got four maze mind tomb. We got uh, four mind stone, four power stone shard, three sculpting steel, three aether flux reservoir, three hendron archive, four Karn the great great creator, three mystic forge, two forsaken monument, two paradox engine, and then for the lands I got a uh, Four Arc of or uh Araska, I think that's what it is. Uh three blast zone, four buried ruin, two inventors fair, three Karn Bastion, four Labyrinth of Scopos, uh, and four Zalf 
Firing Void. Um, and then for the sideboard, we got one Tomas Crypt, one Graph Dickers Cage, which uh, you only want to ever use Graph Dickers Cage in an absolute emergency because Graph Dickers Cage will shut our deck off because we won't be able to use Mystic Forge with this out. So just remember that. Uh, one Sorcerer Spyglass, uh, one Arcane Encyclopedia, one Eighth of Flux Reservoir. We do have all our combo pieces in the sideboard to be able to fetch them up with Karn. That's why we're only running three in the main deck. Uh, one Helm of the Host, one Lithoform Engine, one Mystic Forge, one Forsaken Monument, one Paradise Engine, one God Pharaoh Statue, one Immortal Sun, one Sphinx of Guild Pack for when we want to get super, super janky and combo it with Chromatic Orary um, and just start, you know, drawing cards and acting real jankish. Um, and then one Meteor Golem. So, like I said, in this deck, we just want to just combo off. We're going to get, get into the action here real real quick, uh, but I just want to explain a, a, a couple of things here. So, uh, Sculpting Steel is really, really important for the deck because it's going to allow you to be able to copy things that um, you may need multiples of at any given time. So, um, it's good for copying Power Stone Shards. It's good for copying uh, Hedron Archives for when you don't have Mystic Forge out, he, he draw an archive, will draw you cards when you need to draw cards. Um, it can copy the book. There's times in the in the games where I need to use Sculpting Steel to copy the book to draw and scry. Uh, and then it can also copy uh, Mystic Forges. So that's that's the main thing that we would probably be wanting to copy is the Mystic Forges because this is what allows us to just chain everything off the top of our deck. So um, when we play um, against energy decks the aetherworks marvel decks they 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 typically just concede either by you just playing karn or if you play karn then you fetch up a uh, source of spyglass and they just auto concede so um you can really go ahead and be oppressive against uh Aether, aetherworks the big bad aetherworks marvel decks right now uh with this deck so um that's good to keep in mind but uh other than that it's just a straight up combo combo off deck so we're gonna go ahead and uh get into the action here <laughs> keeper hydra 66 oh i might need to call captain america here <clears throat> Let's see what i got keep that on top hydra Oh, you playing mono black colorless? <laughs> A power stone, power stone shard. Scry. Uh, yeah, I guess I want this on top. I need, I need the land. <clears throat> Drop my monument. So this, it appears that to be that Hydra is playing black artifacts. <laughs> oh, mastermind acquisition. That means I gotta try to I gotta try to end the game now, cause he may he may have tutored up his combo piece. I might not get another turn. <clears throat> All right, ooh, sculpting steel. All right, let me get um. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna tutor up uh. Engine, paradox engine. That's right. You better use your tome. For Karn resolves. <clears throat> All right, I'm gonna have to go into high concentration mode here. Let's add manas. Uh, yeah. Let's play. Let's see here. Let's let's play. I'm gonna play the sculpting shield on my shard. 
I need the manners. <clears throat> All right. Uh, it's QQ, right? To add mana. Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, draw a card. Another paradox engine. All right. Let's cast this uh, this tomb. Uh, let's draw a card. Oh, great. Another tomb. Add manas. I'm sorry, guys, if I don't joke as much as I usually do, but I gotta concentrate for this. Alright, land. <clears throat> Draw me a spell. There we go. Uh, I'm gonna copy. I think I need another book. Copy the book. Let's go ahead and draw. Fair. Uh, add manas. Draw. All right, idle. Cast the idle. Add manas. Draw. All right, Forge. We we in there now. <laughs> this game is over. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Cast. Casting. You like my brain? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go ahead and put this land on bottom. Another Forge. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> Let's keep going. <laughs> going up against trash. Trash. <laughs> I like the brain. I like brains. I like the zombie. I like brains. Oh, you are trash. You're playing blue. Trash player. Trash. Oh, and counter spells. Yeah, you're definitely trash. Alrighty. Oh, this is this is blue tempo. Blue tempo. <laughs> Wants to counter all my stuff. It's gonna be too many things for you to counter. Um. Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and want to counter my archive. No. Want to counter my idol? No. <laughs> I have to ask permission for everything now. <clears throat> well, we know those last three cards in his hands are counter. Those last three cards in his hand are counter spells. Counter? All right. Maybe. Maybe it's not. <laughs> Tone. Oh, maybe he doesn't have counter spells. Um, uh, I think I want to blow up his guys. They're all one drops. Yeah, let's let's do that. <laughs> oh, you're saying good game. <laughs> good game. <laughs> now you have no guys. I hope you drew some more. Be ashamed if you didn't. Pretty trash. Be a be a pretty trash scenario if you didn't. <laughs> uh, let me scry. Yeah, definitely want that. Flash. You got something you want to flash in? That'd be pretty trash of you. <laughs> Cry? <laughs> you crying because you have no creatures? <laughs> oh, thought he was going to counter it. Uh, don't need this land. 
Don't need that land either. All right, yeah, that's what I that's what I want to see. Uh, let me. I bet this gets countered. Counter. Yep. <laughs> oh, it was lofty denial. I, I could have. Oh, it doesn't matter. I can get it back. I can get it back. I have buried ruin. Oh, bracing bar. All right. Well, I have a forsaken monument. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to pay for that. <clears throat> uh, it's gonna eat up all my mana. Got one mana left. All right, I'm gonna have to take another hit here. I think I want to put this. Nah. Uh, I can I can draw the land. I can scry it away. If I if if I really don't want it. All right. Taking eight here. It's most likely gonna pick up some counter spells. But we got plenty of mana. So the counter spells we ain't really the ones we gotta pay extra mana for we ain't too concerned with. Um uh, me let me go ahead and scry this land away. And all these lands. Uh might as well go down to two. I got I got a monument out, so I'll be gaining life. Alright. Uh sculpting steel. <clears throat> What do I want to sculpt and steal here? Um, uh, I could bury ruin and get my my uh, reservoir back. No, let, let me just go ahead and I'm gonna cast this. Oh, there's a reservoir on top. Um, let me let me copy the book. Play my land reservoir. Uh, no Paradox Engine yet. Man, all these lands on top. Alright, let me get rid of this land. Alright, there's a Shard. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, finally, there's a Karn. Trying to keep track of my mana here. I got enough. I can fetch up Paradox Engine and then I can cast the book off top. Alright, and that's that's gonna wrap this up here. <laughs> I just just go to town here. Oh <laughs> good game. <laughs> it's good game for real now. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> not even gonna play with this guy. I'm just gonna go ahead and kill him. He had me down to three. He deserved to die. Die. <laughs> All right, about time. I'll put one of these idols back. Don't need two of those. Oh, maybe I maybe I did. <laughs> I got, I got a feeling he's he's gonna take my idol. If uh if it was me, that's what I would take. I'm being severely punished on the mulligan, getting turn one thought seized by the hominous nocturner. The bat, <laughs> that which is on the Thought Seize card. Come on, man. It's taking a long time. <laughs> All right. Gonna need to pick up some lands here. Soul Guy Lantern. What are you gonna do with that? 
Oh man, you just picking on my idol. What my idol ever do to you? You don't you don't have any idols in your life? <laughs> you don't idolize anybody? It's unfortunate. Everybody needs idols. Alright, please scry land. Alright, thank you. <laughs> thank you. I need back to back lands here. Alright, is this a gate to the afterlife deck? It appears to be. Let's see what he discards. Noctis taking a long time here to make these decisions. Decisions, decisions. Make a decision. Indecisive. Hmm. Uh, I don't think this is a... This may not be a gate to the afterlife deck. I don't know. All as I know is, if I don't pick up a land here, I'm in trouble. Alright, let me, let me add a counter on my blast zone here. Tezzeret the Schemer. Okay, God, this must be some Tezzeret jank. Oh, there's a land. Um. Well, I think I just get my my mana down. It's priority number one. This guy's playing some some Tezzeret jank. I think this is the first Tezzeret I've seen. First Tezzeret deck I've seen since uh. Kaladish came out. Alright, get my monument down. And I uh, pass. What is this guy trying to get to here? Another anointed possession. Getting all these artifacts. These uh, wannabe treasure tokens. What does his ultimate do? Oh, the beginning of upkeep. Beginning of combat. Target artifact becomes a 5-5. Five, five. Alright. It's pretty threatening. Uh, I think I just go off here, though. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try. Noctis. Taking so long. Emerus call. Oh, he's gonna get. He's gonna get. Oh man. Well. <laughs> um. Yeah, I better. I better end the turn. I better end the game now. Um. All right, let's go. Uh. Yeah, corn. Let's uh find. We need the engine. Got mana to cast the book. Untap my mana. Uh, yeah. Let's cast the. Hold on. Yeah, I get. I get three mana. So let's cast the power stone. Uh, add the mana. This will net me one mana. Cast my reservoir. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and uh, draw a card. Oh, perfect. Perfecto. Oh, yes. <laughs> This is over. <laughs> Knock this. No, oh, it's nice. He's lands out of here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right. 
Let's get rid of this. Another power stone. Knock this. Let's go ahead and kill him. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> This is a quality hand. Excellent. And I'm feeling excellent. I'm now one with the dragons. Took a hit of some good sativa. See if I can play a combo deck while I'm one with the dragons with Sarkin. One with the dragons! Salt I control here. Is that what I'm up against? Karn? Oh man. Stand down. Yeah, I, I guess I have to stand down. What, what is Karn doing in this deck? That this is not a Karn colors deck. This is Salt Tide. Oh man, he's got dampened spear. Alright. Play my Karn. I guess what can I get here oh uh, I need to get rid of Karn could get monument uh, spyglass doesn't stop Karn's static ability so I think I, I get monument and then I can use Karn next turn to tutor up meteor golem so yeah, let's go with that. Let's roll with that. With that plan. I will not lose another friend. Oh man, he's gonna shut off my corn. Oh man, this sucks. What is this like? This deck is like all the answers for my deck. <laughs> Why is corn even in that Sultai deck? And damping spears gonna make all my stuff more and more expensive the more stuff I cast. Alright. Uh play monument. Need the extra manas. Stamping spear. Alright. It's gonna make all my stuff cost one extra for each thing for each thing I cast and thank you. it doesn't stop my lands from adding extra mana though uh, I think I just need to I need to get permanence on board so I can draw cards get my life total up Corn, man, corn. Gotta get around corn. Need a blast zone. Blast zone can get. I can uptick blast zone and get rid of corn. Oh, oh. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get that down. Uh, this person may have hand disruption, so let me go ahead and get this stuff out of my hand while I can. And I'll uptick the blast zone next turn. All right. I'm going to try to muscle my way out of this. From under this car. Oh, man. That's bad. <laughs> yep. There's that hand disruption I was worried about. Well, luckily I got my life total up to 30. Man, this guy killing my high. I shouldn't smoke before this matchup. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and uh, uptick the blast zone. Oh man, I meant to I meant to I meant to put four counters. Oh well. Uh Play this. Uh, 
keep gaining these lives. All right, I'm gonna have to uptick my blast on again. Man, I, I meant to put three counters on it. All right, what, what you got, man? Locking up my board with this corn with one loyalty. He's not even worried about upticking his corn. He's just letting it sit on one loyalty. Damages. My adventure spirit gaining me one life, though. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and uh let's put the blast zone up to four. Gotta get rid of corn. I'm have to take some more damages. Hopefully he ain't able to kill me. Uh I can't even activate my my Maze of Eth. One man off. Because all my artifacts are locked up. Oh, wait, I can't activate my Maze of Eth. What? Ugin? Man. Well, at least Ugin can't exile my board. <laughs> at least I got that going for me. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, swing in. <laughs> oh, I should have made something. Oh, man, I forgot. <laughs> All right. Uh, up to four. I'm going to blow up his corn. I'm going to lose my forges. Oh, and my archive. All right. Uh, now that I got all this artifact mana, let's. I gotta win this. I gotta win now, cause I won't, won't get another turn. So let's play Karn. Oh, we still got Spyglass up there. Ah! God dang it! Uh, let's go ahead and draw. Yeah, you don't, <laughs> you don't even want corn on the board. Alright, uh, I can play Inventor's Fair and fetch up my last forge that's in the deck. Yeah, let's do that. Forge. Forge, where be you? Oh, there he is, right there. <laughs> and let's go ahead and get this down. I think we got this now. I think we got this. Yeah, buddy. Woo! <laughs> we go ahead and uh, I'm gonna copy my forge. Got two forges now. <laughs> it's over, buddy. Buddy! <laughs> Oh, this is expensive sculpting steel. I copy my forge. Buddy! Buddy! <laughs> you had me all the way down to three. But now, it's Toby McGuire time. It's. E it's, it's Bully McGuire. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. All right. I don't want this. Let me go ahead and put this down. 
Exile. Don't need this land. Don't need this land. Alright, let's go ahead and uh draw. Things are getting expensive here. Need some more mana. Go ahead and uh copy my power stone. Yeah. Archive. Alright, we, we good on we good on manners now. Another power stone. You almost had me, buddy. LBD! <laughs> yeah. Oh, corn. Gonna give me a bunch of life. The corn that you hate so much. Look at that 80 mana. <laughs> yep. Leo Cole, ninety three. Were you born in nineteen ninety three? I would assume that's what that means. It's like I can scry too. You're not the only one who can scry stacks. Yeah, I need the manas. Need the manas. This mono black mud. Hmm. I don't have a tome yet. So you've got you got all the books. You got all the knowledge. I have none. I'm just an idiot right now. <laughs> Alright, uh let's get this down. Oh, red presents. What is going on here? Well, this is interesting. I haven't seen red presents since it was in standard. Nobody plays with it. Uh, well, let me go ahead and uh, play Karn. No, hold on. Yeah, let me get my mana down. Then I can... uh. Play Forge. And I'll play Karn next turn. Don't want to rush Karn out right now. Want to hang on to him a little while longer. I want him to die. Karn's my friend. When he's on my side. When he's on the opposite side, opposite side of the field, he's he's a very bad enemy. <laughs> All right. All right, let's go Karn. Yeah, Paradox, yeah, I'm gonna get Paradox in and just make sure I got enough mana here. Opponents running black. They may have Thoughtseize. Don't want my Paradox engine getting Thoughtseized out of my hand. Leo Cole, you cannot activate that. <laughs> Looking at Karn. Yes, Karn shuts that off. He closes the book on you. He doesn't want you getting any education. <laughs> That's not a swamp. Oh, Liliana. <clears throat> Well, haven't seen her in a while. This like this deck is like a flashback deck, like <clears throat> flashback to glory days of, of all the standard black good cards. All right, what do I want to do here? <clears throat> Let me add my mana. Play the reservoir. Uh, let's go 
go ahead and play the shard. Oh, I gotta get this land off the top of here. All right, there's a corn. Add mana. I think I'm gonna just uh. Yeah, you better use those while you got a chance. <laughs> <laughs> Gain all that life. Gain all that life. Alright, coin resolves now. Alright, let me get another forge. I don't want to stall out here. I will not stop. You heard corn. Go ahead and get this fair off top of here. Don't need this bastion either. Oh man. Land pocket. Let's scry it away. Alright. Yeah, I'd say this is over now. Go ahead and play it out. For Leo Cole. Go away, Bastion. We don't need you. Go away. Take another forge, though. Go ahead and kill him now. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Kaboom. <laughs> That's how you do it. Aether Flux, Super Combo, Stack Style. Please remember to subscribe, like, all that good stuff. Please leave comments down below. Leave comments down there. It helps the videos out. Helps the channel grow. Share my videos. Share the channel on your social medias. All that good stuff. 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 <laughs> all that good stuff. Do that. Do that for your boy. Help a brother out. Help the channel grow. I appreciate all of you. And I will see you all next time.